What is up everybody? Welcome back to more Pokemon Brilliant Diamond. So I looked at the map <clears throat> and it looks like, well I remember when I was in the cave earlier, or Mount Cornette earlier, and I, I cut the part of the video out, but I, there was a rock and I pushed, or I, when I used strength and went down, I couldn't go down. So we're probably going to have to go in from here and just go up. That's just what it looks like. It said, stop Team Galactic at Mount Cornette's summit. So that's what we're going to do. We have Surf, we have Rock Climb, we have everything we need to navigate this cave. Speaking of which, we have Max Repel that we are most definitely going to use. So I said last episode was probably going to be the last hoorah with Team Galactic. I was sorely mistaken. A bottle of protein. Um, this episode is probably the last hoorah with um, Team Galactic. Let's use this super repel first. No, damn it. Shit. We just, well, I don't guess it's a waste. So we wasted the super repel. Walk slow, Seth. You stupid son of a bitch. <laughs> now we wasted it. <laughs> Why do I walk so fast? <laughs> to me why does it why does this game hate me right now you literally you you literally just saw me walk around this three times we've got to go there right I mean that's where we're headed I'm assuming right Am I wrong? Jesus Christ, dude. I spent the first three minutes running in a circle because my stupid ass couldn't... Anyways. <laughs> Good lord, that was a mess. Hey, a max potion. Items galore, baby. Let's go. With any luck, we won't have to use every single repel we have, but if we do, we just do. I bought them for a reason. Looks like we need to go out over there, though. <laughs> yes. Or no, we we don't go out here. <laughs> Thought that was too easy. No, I mean, if you haven't noticed, it's not hard for me to get turned around. Ooh, man. <laughs> Thank God. I'd hate it for y'all to have to see me walk in a circle again. Oh, 
That's bullshit. <laughs> he walked over there. He, he straight up walked over there. Man, I was trying to get out of that so bad. Your poor Bronzor is going to go down, though. Man, it's a level 39. Levels are getting higher here. I'm assuming we're going to have one more big battle at the end. I'm sure everybody's levels are going to be extremely high. Which is fine if that's the case because... What we've been training for. Here we go. This looks right. Ah, okay. I'll take it. I'm assuming there's nothing but items over here, but am I wrong? Definitely going to the summit here. Getting colder. Aw, oh, damn you. I think I'm trying not to battle. If I can help it. Afraid of no dust ox. <laughs> I love that we're just we're bouncing after every single one. What, what's going on here? Gold duck finally catching up with everybody. Ah, uh, yeah, let's put the hell of it. Switching Star Raptor, save some of our moves. Awaiting my direction or instruction or whatever it said. I feel like we have a very well rounded team right now. I hope when we get to the Elite Four, I hope that we don't have much trouble. I mean, I hope our team's well-rounded enough to be like, you know what, we can do this. I don't remember the Elite Four in this game. Level 50 Infernite, baby. Level 45 Mature. Another one. <laughs> it's like we're gonna make you battle some of these. Flamethrower hasn't let us down against a Stunky yet. Hmm. 
Yeah, why not? I don't know what episode this is. We're getting close to episode 30 if this isn't episode 30. These Pokemon series are always some of my longer series, though. I can usually keep a series under about 30 episodes, but it's hard to do with a Pokemon game. Star Raptor leveled up. Rosalia's close. out in the cold absolutely repels our god right now a red candy <laughs> random random barrel shows up and helps figure we probably got to go in there but For the sake of everything, let's, well, I don't know. Maybe we don't have to go in there. Damn! I was gonna say it's kind of not looking like we have to go in there. It looks like we're going the right way here. I don't know. We don't have to go in there. You know, Bronzor has an evolution, right? Like it's a Bronzong or something like that, or is that the is Bronzor the evolution? I don't think it is. Why has there not been a Bronzong anywhere? Like it seems to me there would be. Petal Blizzard. Probably. Oh god, yeah. Um let's get rid of Toxic. <laughs> Everything else does something. Let's get rid of Toxic. Which reminds me I, I should have taught Rosalia the uh, poison jab move. Glamiao. I switch. No, I won't. We can take down a Glamia with our power up punch or something. Should be able to. If you can't tell in my voice, it's like four in the morning. I'm like super tired. I'm trying to truck through this, man. I recorded like the last like six or seven episodes just back to back. Fight this dude too. No choice. <laughs> Late at night is about the only time I can record though. So. Unless no one's home in the middle of the day, which is very, very rare that someone's not here. Especially my little boy. My little boy would love to record, but... Maybe someday. But during those times, I, I do play that's when I go around and grind a little bit. I'll, I'll battle the trainers I didn't battle and explore a little bit of what I might have walked by or whatever. Like this 
mountain would be a good a good thing to go back to probably. I really haven't skipped many trainers. I skipped several up there, I think, going up to Snow Point City. But not not probably a whole whole lot. <laughs> I'm trying my damnedest. It's like man. Got three. Man, if, you know, if they all had like one, maybe two, it's not so bad. I'm, uh, I am gonna switch in. Luxray. Let's try Thundershock. Damn, I was afraid of that. Thundershock's my move I need to use if they tank out the other one. Luxray's growing though. That's all that matters. Man, they all have the same exact Pokemon. It's unreal. Let's try a Flame Wheel. See if it works. Probably work about as good as that Thundershock did on Golbat. Or maybe it'll be better. <laughs> better is good. New, no, I'm gonna... I'm gonna keep Infernape in and we're gonna end this. We gotta be getting close to the top. We have to be getting close. We fought like three or four of these grunts like back to back here that we can't skip. <laughs> Please be the end. Yes, the spear pillar, baby. Let's go. Something huge is going to happen, I think. Maybe, right? Don't meddle around. Of course you're going to two, aren't you? That's why the two of us will team up to take you down to the ground. Fuck. I see three other people up there. Well, this is going to work out just splendidly. All right, everybody go through their losing attacks and this and that and the other. Come on. Flamethrowers on Stunky. Aerial Ace Dust Ox, and this should take care of these two. Okay. Gold Duck's about to level up again. Man, it just works out so perfect.
so perfect. So we've at least got three more battles, it looks like, because yeah, there, there were three people up there. Cyrus was one of them, and then the two of the commanders. I guess the two we didn't fight. Let's go, Golduck. Let's move Wonder Room. I don't know what is Wonder Room. No. <laughs> it doesn't, uh, doesn't help us. You know, as far as that stunky goes, I think it is like a dark type or something. A dark slash poison type. So we could probably use Golduck, a Golduck Psychic or Zen Headbutt against it. It might work better. I'm not sure about that though. Probably one of those deals where I put it in and think it's going to work pretty good and then it flops horribly. All right, let's get up here and do this. Oh, that was just pathetic. We're just going to let you pass so you can get pulverized by our bosses. Yeah. Who do we fight at the thing? Mar or was it, was it Jupiter or Saturn? Is that who we fought? Saturn? Now all will end and everything will begin with this red chain. I will pry open the portal to another dimension. I command that you unleash your power for me. Dialga, the mythical Pokemon and the master of time. Dialga. This is brilliant, Donna. There it is. This will bring about the destruction of all things. With everything gone, there will be no fighting and no strife. Can you feel time distorting? Only I can choose to stop it. Shit's getting wild, yo. There's Drift Bloom. <laughs> or Drift Bloom or whatever it is, just hanging, chilling down there in front of the weather station. This is the mythical Pokemon that created Sinnoh. Dialga, the ancient deity of time. This world cannot be molded into the ultimate world I seek. It's far easier to create an entirely new world than to change this one. A new world in which I am the ruler of all things. I shall become a deity. Damn. Here's Mars. There's no need to rush. I can understand you want to battle our boss real bad, but you'll have to go through me first. After all, you've made me look bad more times than I care to remember. And I'll be next. You might be tough, but this time the gloves are coming off. Hey, look who it is. <laughs> Hold on one second. Don't you start the party without me. <laughs> well, if it isn't the little boy who ran off crying at Lake Acuity. Did you get any tougher since then? We'll beat you two on two. Teaming up with old Ambrose here. Let's go. Mars and Jupiter. Well. Hey, look, he's got a Munchlax. <laughs> I wish I had a move that would, like, hit both of them. Well, this is Mars and Jupiter, and we, we fought Saturn at the headquarters <laughs> skunk tank I'm gonna take down this bronze ore real quick that I know we can take down. Let's go, Infernape. Fl 
flamethrower. Ooh, he's paralyzed. Her ugly's mine. <laughs> Man, if I had an earthquake or something, it'd be beautiful, right? Gotta get somebody out of here. Let's keep let's keep rotating them out, baby. Let's go. Paralyzed. Let's go. Damn it! It's gonna bring the choke out. It's not really. It, I don't really like how it doesn't give me an option to do that. Gold bat. Uh, I really, really, really think we need to get her ugly out. Team up battles are cool, but it's like, I don't like that it doesn't give me the option to switch people out. Star Raptor and Machoke leveled up. I mean, we can still sw swap them out, it's just, it just kind of doesn't work the same. I don't know, we are going to have to heal up big time after this fight before we take on uh, Cyrus again. Let's take this one down. The pressure brought Lux where I am, but forget it. Rosalia getting some good levels. I hope I have like an elixir or something. <laughs> I've relied way too much on flamethrower. And I probably could have used like flame wheel there and been fine. Is that it? Mars and Jupiter, we just kicked Uranus. <laughs> Ugh, I let myself out. That was that was bad. You toughened up, but you're no match for our boss. That's my girl like grunt voice. <laughs> My Pokemon are tough, right? Right? <laughs> I can get even tougher. But you know, that's it for us. We've hit the wall. Seth, I'll help you with this. <gasps> Did he heal us? Yes! <laughs> yes! Hey, Seth. This is it. It's your show now. Appreciate that, Ambrose. Oh, Dialga. This is... Fantastic. Beautiful. It's the creation of a new galaxy. My new world. What? It's like, oh great, now you've just summoned a Dialga to just walk the earth. Mm. 
the red chain. It crumbled away to nothing. But why? Why would Mesprit, the Pokemon of Lake Verity, appear by your side? But never mind that. It's all destroyed. My galaxy is gone. I won't allow this. I will capture those three again and craft another red chain. But before I even think about that, I'm going to completely crush you. Let's do this then, Cyrus. We just beat you a little bit ago, man. Ooh, a hunch crow. That's new. Yeah, I probably can do it, but I am gonna send Lux right in for this one. Hopefully Honchcrow doesn't one hit us. Ooh, man. A critical hit. Mmm, tanked it. Tanked it, man. Man, he's hit me hard. Fuck, he used a full restore. You son of a bitch. <laughs> we gotta get this spark off first. Yes. Way to do work, Lex Ray. And got a level out of it. Thunder Wave. I don't think Thunder Wave actually does anything though. Outside of just paralyzing somebody. Yeah. <sighs> no, we probably need to leave Luxray in for this. I need to heal Luxray, but if we can get this uh, spark off, we might be in good shape. I was gonna say, what? What even happened there? Not earthquake. Damn. Well, you know, he is a dragon type. We have Ice Beam. Golduck, I need you here, ma'am. I need you bad. Same level, too. Damn! That did not do what I was hoping it would do. Well... What I'm going to probably have to do is... Revive Luxray. Man, that Ice Beam didn't do damn thing. I was really hoping that would, uh... I was hoping that would do, do some work. Uh, we'll try it again, though. He tanked it! Oh my god, if he doesn't use a full restore here, we could, uh... Yes, he didn't! Oh my god, Golduck, you are the bomb. Golduck and Infernape. Oh my god, man, that was rough. Infernape wants to learn the move. Acrobatics. 
I don't know what that is. It's a flying move. Yes, we're not learning that. It'd be probably a cool move to have, but nah. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. We're gonna put old Infernape back in. Yeah, Golduck, you did great. Even if Ice Beam didn't do what I was hoping. It was against a water type Gyarados, so. Yes! That's what I'm talking about. Oh, he does have a Crobat now. Um, you know what? Yeah, let's send in Luxray again. Man, I hope Luxray can hang in here. I might actually... Uh, I think I know what I might do here. I might try to use that Volt Switch move. That's an awfully gorgeous crowbat you got there. No! Oh. Oh, wow. I actually yelled no and it's avoided due to my shout. That's hilarious. Um, you know what? We don't even have any other electric types. We have to put Infernate back in. It's okay. I could probably use a fire blast and it'd be okay. Oh, that sucks. Ooh, damn. I really need that to land this time. <laughs> Is that it? Team Galactic Boss Cyrus. I won't accept this. The power spoken in mythology. I didn't just make it obey me. I made it my own. What is truly the ultimate to you? What do you consider perfection? The most important thing, what shines the brightest, telling you is meaningless, but I will not give up. I will become a deity one day and I will make the ultimate mine. Well, since we're here, hey, look who it is. Dialga, the master of time. It's impossible to tell if it's enraged or saddened. But to me, Dialga appears to be waiting for you, Seth. It seems to be challenging you as a test. Go on, Seth. Face up to Dialga. Listen to its heart. Understand its thoughts. Dialga is out of control after being dragged out by the red chain and forced to use its power. Dialga seems to be trusting you to stop it. Seth, I ran into Ambrose a little while ago. He said that he believed in you. He said that you could get the job done. I feel the same way. Please help that Pokemon. It's suffering from being dragged out by Team Galactic. Well, there's only one thing to do here. We're not going to fight Dialga. Why would we fight Dialga? I remember, I, I know I talked about it way back, but uh, in Super Smash Bros. Brawl, I loved when you could come to, I think one of the levels was the Spear Pillar here. The Sky Pillar, whatever it's called. And uh, Dialga and Palkia would show up. We shall use the Master Ball. And Dialga will come home with us. That dipshit gave us the Master Ball. 
Brave Bird. Sure, maybe. Oh god. Um Yeah, we'll get rid of wing attack. <laughs> I didn't even read what it did. I just thought it did a lot of damage. Getting all kinds of good levels out of this. Dialga, let's go, man. Send it to a box. Seth, I don't know how you, you were magnificent. Truly, you were incredible. I've lived for 60 years, but I've never been thrilled like this. Since the last time the professor did a lot of research, he became very concerned about you, Seth. So he came out to a place as treacherous as this. Seth, I'm so glad you're safe. Let's go home. Oh, I want to go to the other side of that. <laughs> no one has the right to take away anyone's future or anyone's world. I've seen these stairs over here. I knew there had to be something. Adamant orb. Can we not just like, yeah, go check up on Sunny Shore City? You know, that sounds like a really, really good idea. We'll fly to Pastoria City. Oh, we can't use that here. Of course we can't use that here. Why would we be able to use that? Can we use an escape rope? Why the hell not? <laughs> Can I use one now? So just step inside the cave and then you can use the escape rope. Out of Pastoria City now? Yes, I would. Alright. I'd say Sunny Shore City has a gem, which is probably gonna be our last gym bad or gym fight. But we're gonna call it quits. This has probably been the longest episode I've had so far, but that is the end of Team Galactic. We caught Dialga. All is well in the world right now. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs>